come close. Yeah. Like Broken even took a set off of him. Yeah. Before. Granted, it was his um another reason why he's not loved is his uh infamous solar planking that he um yes brought onto the scene. Yes. But I believe we're gonna get Sora Falco. Yep. I hear that Sora. Oh, it's Sora. Unless they're doing a button check. Oh my goodness, we're seeing Sora versus Falco. I think they're just hopping right into the game. Nope, yep, they are into it. This is interesting pick coming out from Tibbers. Not even remotely what I would expect. Yeah. I think he's not feeling it since like his previous three characters. The last set that he played against Resta was Yeah. His, it was not good for him. His confidence must like might be shot from that, honestly. I feel like that's just what happens when people pick Sora. Like, I feel like there's nothing to be confident with in this character unless you know every combo and you nail everything that you do oh yes so this character I'm, I'm gonna say it not that good not i that good. Mm, i would i might be biased but i would argue against that you see this character does have like stuff going on like it's like you said though the combos are kind of very rough to try and get down this character does have certain things like certain easier conversions like the narrative to up smash the narrative right any smash attack and just some guaranteed combos but um, I believe, like, now, did I, would I want to see him play Sora in this matchup? No, I would have loved to see yeah. the Kazuya come out. Maybe, I think Kazuya like is said, the his, Maybe, like you said, his confidence might be like, I don't want to play Kazuya right now, you know? It's very possible. He might have been playing the Sora in friendlies, and he was just like, you know what? This is working well. Yeah. And honestly, it seems to be working out pretty well for him right now. Yeah. He's did a 40% lead. That's pretty good. He's been playing the Sora more and more, and, like, um... Definitely one of the uh, the few surviving swords after everybody said they were going to main him. Um, that was a really good stall in the air. Like, that's, that type of stuff is what you what this character shines on. He's, like, getting those mix-up on the combos. He's a very combo-centric character. That would have been a huge conversion if he got that Blizzaga. Alright, we're seeing him go for a lot of Nair, or fair ones just to try to, like get something off of it, but he's not really going for a second option immediately. Like, he needs to pick something and go with it. Yeah. Very good at trying to swat away Falco because he knows Falco has the speed in order to just catch him. Very yeah. good. I think Imago honestly should be less focused on trying to edge guard Sora and just try to focus on ledge trapping Sora. Yes. Because you need, to, like, you need to close the distance on this character. Yeah. Absolutely. I know it seems very annoying with like sometimes you see how Sora plays, but like the second you get in, his moves are very slow. He doesn't have a single fast move in his arsenal. I believe his fastest move is like Fate 7 or something like wow. that. Which is like, okay. Against a character like Falco, you're like, I need a way faster move to get him off me, you know? All right, well, Sora is still doing incredibly well. I did not yeah. even realize Imago, like, it only has one stock in the situation, whereas Tibbers has two. That's yeah. that's pretty crazy lead to go off of. But Falco is known for those explosive cutscene combos. Exactly, and he's gonna shield the downer that he almost didn't get. He almost gets a better punish, but he's unable to. And just get the short hop, trying to get the fair. He's very close to evening up the set. Like it, like I was saying, the second Sora is in his zone, that is when he shines. That's when he gets all these makes up. That's when he can just control the pace of the game, you know, with his spells, his combos, his three hits. And the second Fal character like Falco gets in is when like you're like, oh please, can we just go back to neutral? Please, I'm begging you. Truly. Yeah, I mean, like, I'm actually, I'm actually enjoying what Tobias is doing right now. I don't know how much of this is like a matchup. Of, I don't think it's a matchup on familiarity thing. I oh, think Tobias yeah, no. is just playing well. Yeah, no, definitely. Everybody's played Sora. Like, yeah. it feels like so. Everybody knows how to play around him. It's just like Tobias is really good at just like dictating the pace like that. You force Falco to approach. That's what you need to do. Ooh, trying to go for the for the counter. Very ballsy play. Yeah. Because the ultimate, the downfall of Falco is he will struggle to get in. But yeah, when you get stuff like it. that, it's it, he dies from that. But like, yeah. you can't struggle to get in on Falco. I mean, Sora is incredibly light, but also Fair is so multi. Like, it's such a good multi tool. It exactly. can drag down. It can multi hit. It can. Uh, it can kill. Yeah, it can if, combo. If, if like, you're off stage, yeah. If you're off stage, you get hit by that Fair. Say good night, pretty much. Like Sora can go flying with that move. He can just drag you. We're gonna see not an attempt on the edge guard. He's gonna just opt for just short hopping at the ledge. Ooh, I really that up there missed. I'm so shocked. Yeah, I really want to see more like. Oh, Ooh. he's doesn't opt for the down air. I believe the down air would not even stay like yet. Such a scary situation. Sora does have the percent lead, but he is still a light character. And if Mimago nails an edge guard right here, then he could easily take it. But we're resetting to neutral. Yeah. 
Both these characters oh, could just kill off a of one fair. Oh, Ooh, he did not. Tibbers. Tibbers is trying to pull that kill trigger. It's not working out for him. Yeah. I really wanted to see, yeah, like, just, just force yeah. him to just waste of time at this point. As much as I hate seeing that sort of gameplay, like, sometimes you need to do that as that character, just, like, occasionally. Yeah, honestly, it's not a bad op option right now, especially no, considering there's two minutes left on the clock. Yeah, exactly. Like, you could take this game to time if you really want to. Yeah. That's it. Yeah, that's gonna take yep. it. Yep. Uppy out of shield. Pretty good. It's like a, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a, I don't even know. It just kills. It's aight. It's aight. It's aight. It's aight. It's a pretty good kill option, like, consistently. Yeah. But yeah, we're gonna see. I I would assume that he's sticking to Sora, and I don't. I think point, Imago, yes. we might, 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 might see a wolf. I would love that, honestly. Wolf I would love very, to see wolf. Wolf is a very awkward matchup for Sora, because like he's a lot faster than like um. Well, not faster in a sense, but like his range his is moves deceptively are good. Yeah, his moves are way faster, yeah. and his deceptively good range. Yes, that's something. Not um, only this, here's what I think Wolf would really excel at in this matchup, is the ledge trapping. Oh, yeah. So, immensely. basically, Wolf has some of the most long-lasting things that can two-frame. And Sora, I think, is as easy to two-frame as Fox. Like, it's it's pretty easy. His up yeah. takes a long time to latch. So, like, it it's a very, very solid choice if he were to pick Wolf. But you're seeing him stick, stay confident with the Falco, and I honestly yeah. love to see it. Like, stick with the character you think that is best for this situation. So one thing I would like to see Tippers do is you always see the stories go for that down throw. I want to see them like him just like wait on that down throw, you know, like just wait for that option. Yes. Oh uh, no, I don't. <laughs> I thought it was important. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, we're gonna see so we retreat to the ledge. Nice Sonic Blade. Ooh, oh, almost getting that raw S smash, but Imago went right above his head. Something I um I was uh, also like to point out is that like. When Imago's off stage, I feel like he's, he's just been like dying every time he goes off stage. But like, Tibbers also have the option of just pressing down B on Falco, and what does Falco do? Whoa, nailing that, the confirm. Yep, that that is one of his best confirms if you're able to get to get it off. And Naren to up tilt is exactly what you want to see. Oh, I definitely would opt for another move there, but. Ooh, okay. That up throw can. Oh, almost yep. nailing it. Oh. Once again, up or not killing. It's not the best at killing, but it's Definitely not. such a solid combo tool that it really does not matter. You punish him at that. Ooh. You see to try to go for that shield and then try to punish the ledger grab. Or even go down there and spike him. He's very vulnerable when you're facing right on top of him. But Amago's not going to be able to do that, and he's just going to get back to back on the stage. Another Nair to F smash. I would have liked to see the up smash there, because I feel like that would have definitely killed. But that bear is going to take it. Yep. Something right. I want to point out is like, again, just two conversions like that. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, seeing the air dodge in. Air dodging against a character like Falco, especially in, just seems like not a good option almost it's ever. It's not. I really love, I really want to see him just go down and down air him, honestly. Because like when he doesn't have like any spells prepared like that, like I guess you can like just try and like short hop on top of him and bait out an up air and then make him not grab the ledge and then just do something like that. Because that's the only Sora's tool when you. Oh, how I'm still. Yeah, that's Sora's pretty much agree. only tool when you're when you're approaching right above him. But if you bait it out with a character like Falco, it can be free. It like definitely real. would not be a bad option. Oh, Ooh. nice job not mashing. That could have yeah. definitely taken your stock right there. Yeah. You definitely need to watch out. And like even so, like well, confirming into the upper, yeah. that's gonna take it. Yeah, that on extra that top rage. platform, on that top platform, it is curtains. But. Um, one thing I, you also can see is a potentially like another mix-up where like if they don't mash, just press up beyond them and they die for sure with that Blizzard. Oh, that missed! That up looked so freaking close to hitting, but it just did not nail it out. And the back air is going to take it. 43% yeah. of extra credit for Imago, but I don't know how... Oh, it's definitely putting in work. Never mind. Yeah, no, Imago is definitely bringing it back. Nice. 91%. To... Yeah. And Sora just has some, some moves that can kill deceptively early. Oh, the nice Nair one to Nair. Oh. This is a fair. Gonna the Sonic Boy. That Sonic Boy's a really good burst option. It's against, the, against an option that has a ledge where they're just far away, you can just burst onto them. Gonna get a fair. 
Oh, that was nice. a really good tech read. That was, that was a very a really good, good, good catch. Yeah. Very confident in the catch. But Ooh, doing his Pasaga in the wrong direction. Yeah. Like there, like exactly right there. Like you see, you know the Sora is going to be in that end lag and he's going to be coming up. You know what you I really want to see? Huh. Tibbers is kind of going in, not really spacing too much. I just want to see a parry down tilt. Honestly, On yeah. On a landing, like, that will kill, that will get the game done. Yeah, he's dead from that. Mogus is, I feel like he's giving Sora a bit too much respect. In, you know? Yeah, absolutely. I, again, you're Falco. You can't approach, but like... There's a like, lot of things that like, with Sora especially, I... I I almost don't know how to deal with it, but then there's like, there's others where it's just like, general game knowledge. Like if he if he just gets that one singular punish on any specific, there we go. That might take. Oh, no, it's not no. gonna take it, but it's gonna be very very close. One fifty versus a hundred. Oh my goodness! And that is why you respect Sora at the ledge. Yeah, that's he why planking's a viable option. It's because that can kill. Yeah, that is like I was about to say, Sora with rage is deceptively strong as well. He is very light, so you don't see him get it off often, but like, it's not always like that. <laughs> <laughs> We're going straight back to Battlefield. Yeah, no. <laughs> Imago's not, not yeah. happy with that. Imago just saying, run that shit right back. Sticking with the Falco. I, I, I feel like he definitely, like, he definitely knows how to play the game. You know, like, that, that's, that's not, that's not, um... Like, not even being suggested, but like, if it's yeah. like certain sore stuff, he's not respecting it, which is, I granted, is scary because that can happen, but like, sometimes you just need to disrespect Sora and get in, you know? Also, I don't think either of these players picked the song, but let it be known that this is one of the best songs in Smash. Exactly. Nobody picks songs, and it always. I always, out. every single time, especially on stream, I will pick songs. Exactly, exactly. We're not, we're not having, we're not having a game five set to, uh, boop it, boop it. Boop. You know, it's not happening. Yeah. I love Yoshi. God damn, does the music suck in this game. Minus the original Yoshi story. That one will always yeah, go hard. Yeah, that one's actually a banger. That one will always go hard. Or the Dinero. All right, we're seeing some, we're seeing some simple Nair combos come out from Sora. Just getting that real, that simple chip damage, and it's working out wonders for him. That reflector is, like, okay in that scenario. But, like, you definitely need to space it out a lot more. Yeah, if absolutely. Because if you're not, you just, like, what happened in the last set, too, in the last game. Oh, that was a beautiful kill conversion. It's like, you just kind of reflect the first hit, and then you Falcon standing in the center like that. But you can also... That's it. Oh, beautiful tech. Oh, my goodness. Another thing. You need to watch for that F smash. What? I, I don't know what it is in everyone's mind, but when someone's charging F smash at the ledge, so many people, they're like, I'm just going to... Come on, you won't. Yeah. You won't do it. You won't. And then, and then guess what? They do. And then you yeah. die for it. And it's like, oh, However, you did it. I would I would like to give Imago some slack because that F smash should last a bit. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. But also, don't neutral get it when someone's charging that too. Smash. That too. Maybe he liked that. Like, oh, yeah, you won't. But he did. He definitely did. <laughs> he did. <laughs> that dare is very long lasting. Obviously not to the same effect of like... Brawl, even brawl there, but like, nice. that's exactly what I was saying. Yes. The was... second you get sore like that, where he commits to an option, he's forced to upbeat. And if you can catch him in that upbeat, it's so free. Yeah. Very solid play from Resta. Down tilt. Elf smash is not going to take oh, it. Resta, sorry, Tibbers. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. No, Imago. Imago. Oh, Imago. my gosh. My my brain is just fried know, right now. Yeah, we know people. It, it's just, um, it's the thunder. We have too many Falcos. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Back off. <laughs> Oh, we almost hit it there. That was oh, that was a really good wait. Again, just just yeah. go down and dare. Just go down and dare. I One feel of like my favorite moments in Smash is where like the entire crowd was just shout, chant, like shouting the, the Thunder. spells. Yeah, fire, back off. I love Sora, but god damn, is he goofy. He just needs to learn to shut his mouth. Yeah, he's oh, oh trust me, someone would be cleared up in Kingdom Hearts if he did. Oh my goodness. That's not gonna be able to take it again. That up, it's it's so sad that Falco has to go for that upper most of the time, you know? Yeah. Cause it doesn't kill, but like it's it's like the one move he for sure can connect. Yeah. Makes sense. All right, we're gonna see trying to. I like like I've been saying, he definitely can just just go on top of him, you know? Yeah, I definitely agree. But like once he hits, that's the, it. That's, that's it. Take it.
That was... Wow. That was a good comeback from Tibbers. That was really strong by Tibbers. At the yeah, end. That, what was he at? Like 80? Yeah. No, wow. he was at like 60 when he got hit by the wow. initial there. Yeah. And then not only that, he had like 130% rage. That's... That is that was, so Yeah, that was almost much. max rage. But that Nair F-Smash... Already very strong. Are, yeah, that F-Smash is really good.